It is Saturday, ladies and gentlemen. So happy Saturday to your faces. Saturdays are for the tacos. Does that make sense? But anyway, every Saturday I have a series which I do, as you can see right here. You're watching it. It's called K.O. Perico Spin the Wheel. And essentially what that is, is I spin this wheel and whatever it lands on is how I have to do the entire heist. From the entry vehicle to the weapon we use to where we have to get secondary loot from to our escape point, everything is decided by the wheel. Now, tomorrow's spin the wheel is going to be a little bit different, as you guys, I'm sure, already know because you've already been voting on it. But I'm going to be adding some things in tomorrow's wheel. I don't know what it is yet, but there's going to be an option on there that one of you guys suggested, which is having a wheel that basically, or a vote, sorry, that basically chooses whether or not a viewer, one of you guys, for the view voted, we do every Sunday, chooses how I have to do the entire thing, or we just do a vote and everyone gets to choose. So that'll be a little bit different tomorrow. We'll see how it goes. If you guys like it, we may do something like that next week for the spin the wheel also. But anyway, it's a beautiful day in Los Santos. Let's go ahead and spin the wheels. All right, so as you can see, we're doing this one first because I still it's it's still here from last week's one. So we're just going to do this one first. This is for disruption. Distru disruption or no disruption. Um, <laughs> but we have a new, we have new, as you can see, um, what, what did you call that? Graphics, I guess. I just updated it a little bit. It probably looks exactly the same to you, but I changed it because I wanted it to be nicer so anyway let's go ahead spin this wheel am i going to be able to do disruption or not and i don't even know what this heist is going to be yet so i don't know whether to be happy about this or not so let's go ahead and spin it disruption no disruption and our survey set it looks like it's going to be disruption stop 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 <laughs> no no <laughs> that was so close okay so now i'm a little bit nervous just because what if this what if it's going to be insane okay anyway let's move on to the regular ones let's go all right so here we go let's just go ahead and spin it the kasaka the alchemist the velum annihilates patrol boat or long fin what vehicle are we going to be using to get to the island don't be patrol boat man oh god okay we're doing patrol boat <laughs> what a it's just so slow. It's just so slow. All right, let's move on. All right, next up, we have what weapon are we going to use? Going to get use? Going to use the aggressor, the conspirator, crack shot, saboteur, or marksman. Our survey says it's going to be marksman. It's going to be marksman. Go on, go on, go on, go on. Do what you did with the disruption and go. You're not going to. You son of a. <laughs> Come on, man. You're really going to do me like that? You're going to get so close. Why Why didn't you do that with the other one? <sighs> it's Saturdays. It wouldn't be a Saturday without everything going wrong for me recently. I feel like when we started this Spin the Wheel series, it was just... We got so much more lucky. Recently, the game's been hating me. But anyway, let's move on. All right, next up, we have the infiltration. This is where we enter the islands, not the main compound. So let's go ahead and spin this wheel. You can see there's more options on the side there. The reason we don't have all of them, like the drainage, because we can't... The drainage is... If you have the Kasaka, you can infiltrate through that way. But if you have something, it's just... Just trust me. This is what we have set up. Anyway, let's go ahead and spin it. West Beach, Main Dock, North Dock, or Air Strip. How are we getting... You know, I don't mind either of these... Okay, main dock. I don't mind that. I don't mind it. We haven't done a main dock entry on a spin the wheel in, I feel like, donkey's years, even though the channel's only five months old. But anyway, let's continue. All right, next up is the entry. This is the entry to the actual compound itself. Um, and in all honesty, I feel like I haven't done a grappling hook in a while, so I'm kind of hoping it's one of the walls, either the south wall, north wall. Um, but anyway, let's see what it is. Let's go ahead and spin this wheel. We're coming in with a patrol boat at the main dock. How are we getting into the compound? It's not going to be a wall. It's going to be the south gate. Okay, that means we need to take out some people, which is always risky because we don't want to trigger the alarm before we get into the compound. But we'll, we'll try our best. We'll try our best. All right, let's move on. Okay, so next up we have the exit point. So once we've got our primary loot, how do we escape? And now this also depends. I mean, this is where we're going to have to escape. But we're also going to have a wheel coming up here soon with, are we going to get our prime, or sorry, our secondary loot before the compound or after? So this could make it very difficult, more so than usual. So let's go ahead and spin it. Is it going to be the airstrip, main dock, north dock, or bottom map? I want it to be bottom map, but this wheel hates me, so it's going to say North Dock. So it's instead... Yeah, okay. Well, you know, I, if I was a betting man, I would have put bloody money on that. All right, let's move on. All right. <laughs> I may have went overboard with the copy and paste, but it makes it a little bit more interesting. 
So this is for secondary loot. Are we going to get the secondary loot before the main compound or after the main compound? Let's go ahead and spin this very colorful wheel that looks brown when you stare at it when it's spinning like that. But anyway, is it before or after? Before. Don't go over to after. Before. Okay, I'm happy with that. I'm happy with that. Even though it would have been fine after if it was like at the North Dock since that's where we're going. Uh, we'll see. We'll see. All right, let's continue. All right, so this one I'm kind of nervous for. This is secondary loot location. Now, obviously, since we're getting our secondary loot before the primary, I want this to land on the main dock. That would make the most sense since that's where we're coming in the main dock. If it would have said we can get the secondary loot after, I would have won this to be North Dock. But literally out of all of these options, there is only one thing I want, which is the main dock. Nothing else, nothing more, nothing less. Now, if I had to choose a second favorite, I would say mid-map, just because that is closest to the main dock. Now, if I had to choose a third, it would probably be airstrip and then North Dock. So anyway, let's go ahead and spin it. It's probably going to end up being bloody North Dock, isn't it? Let's be honest with ourselves. The wheel hates me. Please, no, keep going. Don't be airstrip, though. This was my third favorite. Oh, God. Uh, I mean, we're talking about getting the elite challenge. We're coming in at the main dock, then having to just go all the way up to the airstrip. And then we have to come all the way back down to go to the main compound. And then we've got to go all the way back up to go to the north dock. This is a stinker. You already know. All right. So I think we have one left, which is going to determine whether I lose my entire mind. Or if I'm going to be okay. I mean, I'm still going to lose it because we're going all over the place for this one. But that is going to be suppressor. No, we're not doing suppressor or no suppressor. Um, that is going to be... So disguise or no disguise. I mean, this is going to make or break my brain. My last brain cell. Because we're also... We, uh, okay, it's fine. Let's just spin it. You, you already know what I want, so... The game already knows. I feel like I need to use reverse psychology and say that I want no disguise. So I want no disguise. That's what I want. I don't worry about giving me a disguise. I want no disguise. <sighs> the reverse psychology didn't work. I hate it. I hate everything about it. All right, so that's it for the wheels. Um, I'm going to go ahead and set up everything the way that the wheels told me I need to do it. So I'm going to do that right now, and then we're going to come back. I'm going to show you the setup, and then we're going to jump straight into the heist and see what we can do. All right, let's do it. All right, guys. So as you can see by my bullet wounds, I am freshly back from setting everything up the way that the wheel has decided. Now, just as a refresher here, we need to go. You know what? We'll do it. We'll look at it when we get into the board here. I'll explain it as we get in. So first thing you can see, we have no disruption, the weapon. We've got the saboteur. And then we've obviously just done, oh, also the setup vehicle, the bloody patrol boat. Let's start this thing up and I'll explain what's happening. I'm also realizing I'm an idiot because I don't have any armor. I just purchased one piece of armor for 500, but I don't have any more armor other than that that I've just purchased. So this could be a, an awful mistake, but we're going to try it anyway. So obviously patrol boat is what we've got. Infiltration point is the main dock. We need to come into the island at the main dock and then we need to go straight up to the airstrip to get secondary loot. Keep in mind, no disguise <laughs> because the bloody wheel hates us this week. It hates us for the past bloody two months, but no disguise. Um, and then once we've got our loot, we need to come all the way back down again because we need to enter the compound through the south gate, which means we need to kill some people to get a key code. Once we've got in, keep in mind, this is no disguise or anything. So this could go awfully wrong. Once we get in, then we get the primary. Once we escape, we need to go all the way back up to the north dock to escape. Again, with no disguise. So it's going to be a disaster. So anyway, without further ado, let's continue. So main dock. <laughs> uh, drainage tunnel, but obviously that's not going to be that. Escape point is the north dock. So we will put that. Time of day is daytime. Let's just get into this, man. I am. Um, what are we going to wear? We got to look. You know what? This looks kind of. We're going to be an army man today. Let's do it. All right. So, as always, we're in the patrol boat. Well, we're not always in the patrol boat, but this is, in my opinion, 
the most useless vehicle in the KO Perico. Okay, I don't understand. I think I'm the only person on YouTube that use that uses this vehicle. Maybe the only person in the world that uses this, and it's because of the wheel or you guys choose me to do it. Now, listen. I understand if you're with a group of people, you can use the gun on the back, you can use the gun on the front. But in the beginning, like this, when you're heading in, there's no reason to use it because there's no bloody one chasing you that you need to shoot. And afterwards, once you escape, the patrol boat has vanished. So it is just pointless. It's slow and bloody useless, man. If someone can let me know in the comment section and let me know why you think this is even... It, it, I don't know. Anyway, let's speed up until we get to the main dock here. All right, here we are, main dock. Now, here's the thing. It, I can't do anything here at the main dock. I can't grab any secondary loot. I can't go and get a disguise. So the only thing I can do is steal a boat. So that's what I'm about to do right now. And this guy's just turned. Come on, do it, move, move. This guy's just turned. So I need to grab this boat before he turns back around. And I don't know exactly how long he's going to take. Where well, I don't even see him. Excuse me, sir. All right, get in this boat. He's going to turn around almost immediately. So I need to avoid him and avoid this guard that's right there. All right, that was perfect. That was per... Did I trigger the alarm? I didn't, right? Did you see what I saw? It, see, it felt like I triggered the alarm. But we didn't, because you'd hear it by now. The guy, I don't know. It just seemed weird. Anyway, so the reason I've stole this boat is because it's the fastest way to get up here. Because since I can't get in the skies, I can't get anything else. I'm not looking for a grappling hook. I don't need to travel around. So, and I'm going to need this to get back to the main dock. Because we're going to have to come in. I don't want to lose this boat. So, eh, that's good enough. Uh, I, I'm going to have to take the boat back down. Because I don't want to um, run back down to the... Because uh, we need to go back to the compound and we need to go in the main gate, basically. Or the, the south gate. So there's just no, there's just no reason, like literally at all. There is zero reason. So anyway, we're going to wait for this guy to pass. Don't turn and start looking at me, my guy. We're going to wait for him to walk past. We're going to go in here, grab some secondary loot. I can see the Jeep coming, so I need to be a little bit quicker here. Excuse me, sir. All right, there goes the Jeep. Um, so <laughs> This is awful. All right, what loot we got? We got some gr grass. I was going to say grass and cash. Nope, just grass. Um, so once we've got this loot, dude, when I see red dots like that and I don't see the cones, it always scares me, but it's, it's okay. We're inside of a building. That's why I can't see the bloody cones. We need to go all the way back down now to the compound. We need to go in the south gate. Once we've gone in the south gate, we need to come all the way back up to the north dock. So even though we don't have a disguise, I do not want to trigger the alarm because... Why is that cone coming in? Like, bugger off, cone! Um, because... <laughs> If we trigger an alarm, getting to the North Dark is going to be almost impossible. Especially since we have no armor. And the reason for that is because we literally... There's going to be roadblocks, essentially. If you haven't triggered the alarm and had to drive up to the North Dark, you'll know what I mean. You, it, there is roadblocks, and they will just shoot you. And since we haven't done any disruption missions, they'll all have heavy weapons as well. Which obviously is not a good thing. Alright, come on. And, uh... Yeah, it's just not going to be fun. So... Don't start shouting at me, man. You're going to give me a heart attack. So anyway, we need to... Basically, the moral, the moral of the story, we need to be quiet. Okay. <laughs> what do you got for me? More grass! Okay. Well, we're getting uh, high on our own supply here today, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, <laughs> no. So this is okay. It's not the worst. It's not cash. There is a painting inside the compound, but obviously we're not going to uh, grab that because... They said we couldn't. They said we could only get grass. That is what's the... Uh, well, the wheel. we actually didn't do that one for the wheel. We did it location by... Uh, oh, we got secondary loot by... Blah, blah, blah. Why am I rambling? We got secondary loot by location, not by item. Why is my brain farting again? Why is it every Saturday we just have the worst luck, man? All right, we're going to wait for this guard to turn around. I'm actually going to hide here because a second ago when he turned around, his cone... When inside this entire building. See? I don't know why it looks like he's looking in here. Look at that. Like, what the bloody hell is that all about? You're just trying to bloody scare me again. All right. As soon as he's walked past, we're bloody out of here. Go on, sir. Thank you. Fast, 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 fast. 
because he turns around immediately, I think. Go, 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 go. I think we're out of his view now. Okay, we're good. Hopefully our boat's here. So we're going to take the boat. Obviously, we can't take the... We can't go in the drainage tunnel. Um, so we're going to have to take this boat to the most southern part of the map. Where's the bloody boat? What's bloody happened here then? <sighs> My day. <laughs> Why does this game hate me? Why did you despawn? It didn't even float away. It just straight up despawned. Whenever I do this, whenever I take uh, one of those boats over here, they always, the dinghy always despawns. Like if I came here in a long fin, the long fin would still be here. But for some reason, when I'm doing it in the bloody dinghy, it despawns. So that means we're just going to have to... This is just going to take forever. How am I going to get a bloody elite challenge? And if you watch the video I did with the randoms on Monday, I said in that video... You know what? Let's just keep running. I said in that video that I never see boats anymore. And I was so excited to see a boat. It was the first time I'd seen a boat. I mean, I don't need this, but we'll pick it up anyway. Uh, it was the first time I'd seen a boat in the water for literally months. And here we are again doing it solo and there's no boats. I swear to you, I don't know what it is. But I think and I truly believe that I... When I'm doing this solo, there is no boats. There used to be boats. But literally, they did a patch like two months ago. And since that patch, whenever I do the Cape Perico solo, there's no boats. Anyway, this part is going to take forever. So let me speed this part up here a little bit because I'm just bloody swimming. Alright, we're halfway there. There's our bloody patrol boat. That's still there. <laughs> oh, we should have just took the patrol boat, but I feel like it would have been cheating, man. I don't know. The good part of there being no boats, though, is there's also no patrol boats here and people looking for me in the water. There's literally no one. I can't be the only one that's dealing with this issue, man. It is absolutely ridiculous. There's just no boats anywhere when I do the KO Perico solo. It's just madness. Anyway... So, I'm trying to, I was thinking while I was swimming over here, how we're going to escape this compound. I was going to just take out the guards that are at the main gate when we escape. Um, but I think instead what we'll do is the strategy where you jump over the wall and grab the motorcycle and just try and avoid people and cameras as much as possible. Um, because we're, chances are we're going to trigger an alarm at some point. But I want to do it as late as possible. A, we have no armor. B... I just, they, we haven't done any disruption missions, so there's going to be just guns ablazing all over the place. Heavy armor, heavy armor, heavy machine guns. It's going to be nuts. Um, so that's the plan. But I am getting a little bit ahead of myself because, you know what? I think, I can't shoot him. This is the only gun we have. I don't think the range on this is going to take this guy out. Oh my God. It bloody did. It did. I'm going to be honest with you. I didn't think the little saboteur SMG was going to work there, but it bloody did. Okay, and it's good because no one's going to be able to take him out up there uh, or see him because he's high up. But we are still going to avoid this camera. I could probably shoot the camera as well, but uh, I'm just not. I'm just not going to do it. We're just running. I already know we're not going to get the elite challenge. I've been swimming for days, okay? I feel like we've been lost at sea. I've been swimming for so long. And now I feel like we've been running for so long. I would have killed him if I could have. I would have. Because we're probably going to have to kill him anyway. It's good that I noticed him though. So that means he's going to be driving around the corner soon. Let's actually avoid this guard. Let's go this way. Now I don't want to trigger anything right now. This is important. Okay. Okay. This is important. So I need to take out this camera. And then... Oh, he dropped the keys immediately. Hmm. So... I can either run as fast as I can and hope there's no... There's a car coming. See, if I would have ran, this guy would have triggered. Okay. So that's good. But now I can run, but there's also a jeep that's going to be coming up here. 
Will I make it in time? Or do I not risk it and just wait for that Jeep that we saw driving down there? Do we just wait for it to come back around? Or do I just run straight down to that gate and hope? Hmm. I feel like going to the other gate will be easier anyway, so we may as well... Okay, the Jeep is coming. I feel like going to the other, the other area is going to be easier anyway. So we need to take out this Jeep. So let's do that real quick. Okay, he's gone. He didn't show up on my mini-map, but it's fine. Now I need to take out these two guys down here. Alright, just squeeze around here. Excuse me, sir. Alright, and then... Sorry if you can hear my controller. I've got it close. I'm nervous. Okay. <laughs> We're good. We're in. We're in. So, so far, so good. No alarms triggered. At least we have the opportunity now to get in and out of here. I need to remember, though, that I don't have a disguise. Because a lot of the time, I have a disguise. And I, it has happened before where I've run around assuming that I'm not going to get caught. Just not realizing that I don't have a disguise on. So, what the plan is now, we're going to stick to the right-hand side. We're going to take out one of the guards. As if we're doing this like the speed run way I did. If you saw me do this with the... Uh... Okay, the panther cage is open. If you saw me do this in my speed run strategy... All right, we'll take him out. All right, let's go up here. All right, let's go. So hopefully... I don't think the Jug sees that body. I don't think he's ever seen it. Because he does come this way, but I don't think he's ever seen that body. All right, so we're just going to wait here for a second for this guy to come past. What am I wearing? I'm wearing my little bloody snorkel mask. It's fine. Okay. So now, we just the, we got stinky tequila too, by the way. So we're already not very excited about what this whole entire heist is, uh, is doing for us. But <laughs> it's fine. There is a painting in here, like I said. Where is it? Right there. But we can't grab that. Well, we've already got full loot bags now anyway. But one of these days, I'll get paintings. The next time I get two paintings in here, we're going to do a speed run. All right, let me speed this part up. All right, it wasn't the fastest one I've done, but it also wasn't the longest one. So I'm not going to complain. Not going to complain. All right, what have we got? Why am I stuck? Move. Okay. So, stinky tequila. This is the plan. We're going to grab the, the tequila. We're going to run upstairs. We're going to run down. We're going to jump down. We're going to try and get out of here. I'm assuming we're not going to trigger any alarms, but I don't want to jinx myself. And then we're going to do the motorcycle strategy. Where we jump over the wall stealthily, grab the motorcycle, and then leave that way. That's going to be the plan. Because we're headed, don't forget, to the north bloody dock is our escape point. So, that's never fun. Alright, let's go back. There's no infinite cone. There's no infinite cone anyway, because we only took out one guard. And that guard never really triggers the infinite cone. Okay, so where is the jug? The jug is just coming. The jug is only just on his way, so I have plenty of time here. Plenty of time. All right, so let's just sprint. That guard is just now getting into his little nook. So I have time to run and jump over here. We have loads of time. And we should have enough time right here to get up. Okay, there we go. This guard may look like he's going to shoot us. Nah. Okay, we're good. Okay, so now... <laughs> Sorry, I'm thinking ahead, but we're just going to do the strategy where we grab the motorcycle and try and avoid all the guards. That's the only thing I can think of. The only problem with this strategy that I have is the guards in the towers. You know what I mean? Like the sniper towers, because they could see me. The guards in the towers could see me. Hold on, I'm trying to avoid... The guards, cones. All right, we've avoided that, so we can swing a right here. Um, yeah, the guards in the towers. Now, I don't know. I've never before, when escaping, got off a vehicle to take out the guard towers. But we may do it today. I don't know. I don't have any armor, like I said. So we're kind of stupid on that one. But it's just, it is what it is. Um, all right, let's jump up here. Jump up here. Grab this motorcycle. And then we need to do a hard left. We could go straight. We just need to avoid that guy's cone. All right, here we go. 
So that guard tower up there, that's the one we need to avoid. So maybe if I go down here a little bit, just go off-roading. Did he see me? He saw me. He saw me. Wait, did he see me? I don't know if he saw me. I don't think he did see me. His cone of vision... There's no alarms going off. Okay, no, we're good. His cone of vision vanished right as the noise went ding. But I assume that was just because... All right, let's avoid this. Oh. This is what happens when I'm looking at my minimap, man. I wasn't even looking. Come on, get back on. Excuse me, sir. Don't mind me. Okay, we're avoiding everyone. Now, I think there's one more tower down here. But I could just drive straight through the middle. You see that tower right there? I think I may be able to drive straight through the middle here. So let's do that. Oh, of course El Rubio's going this way. Why the bloody hell wouldn't he? Oh, God. Now the guard's looking this way. God, can you face the other direction, please? Ah, oh, this is annoying. Um, all right, let's try and cut through. I'm looking at the mini map. I'm also looking at El Rubio. This is the disaster. Okay, don't hit anything. Oh, there's a guard there as well. All right, we've made it. El Rubio is, looks like he's right next to me, but isn't looking at me. So I'm going to just oh, hit a wall. Oh, God, come on. Okay, so far, so good. So far, so good. My palms are sweating, but so far, so good. All right, El Rubio looks like he's going towards the airstrip. All right, we're still, we're still doing this. Okay, so we're going to avoid... Okay, no. You know what? Should I take him out? I don't even know if I can. We bloody did. We bloody did. I don't think anyone's going to see his body. Okay. Okay. All right. We're, we're doing things. I can't believe we've done this. For God's sakes. You know what? I'm just running. We're not taking the bloody bike. Do I have armor? No, of course I don't. I already know that. I can't believe we've made it this far without bloody triggering any alarms. I am very incredibly proud of myself. Okay. There is a patrol boat coming. I can hear. Oh, God. There's someone walking towards me. Where the hell was that guy two seconds ago? Oh, God. Oh, God. Where's this guy? This guy needs to die. This guy on the other side of the river. Okay. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. Is there a boat here? There is a boat right here. Okay, get in the boat. Get in. We have made it. How is this possible? I don't even think I've done this ever. Don't see me, vehicle. No. Oh, my God. <laughs> no! <laughs> oh, man. This is a disaster. This is an absolute stinker. What am I doing? How did I do that? I'm just panicking. I'm just panicking, that's all. I'm just panicking. I feel like there's a guard. All right, we've triggered the alarm. We've triggered the alarm. I was going to say, I don't think I've ever done this without triggering the alarm. And even though we almost did, I'm, I'm taking this as a win. I'm taking this as a win. I mean, it's not a win technically because I don't think we're anywhere close to the elite challenge. But look at that. A bloody boat. How did I beach myself, man? How the hell did I beach myself? Where's the hell? Okay, there's a patrol boat. There's two patrol boats on the way. Look at that. It's all right. We're too quick. We're too fast for you guys. We're too fast. We're way too fast. Where's the helicopter? Well, Rubio left, but where's the bloody buzzard? Oh, there he is. Okay, there's the two helicopters. You're too far away. I have nothing to worry about. I'll tell you. I mean, I triggered the alarm there at the end. I couldn't believe that we almost made it out of there without triggering the alarm, without a disguise, without anything. That was quite impressive, if I do say so myself. The fact that we beached the bloody dinghy there, that was embarrassing. That was an absolute embarrassment, but... It's fine. I don't... We, it doesn't matter. I don't think we got the Elite Challenge anyway. If I was a betting man, I'd say that took us around... 
God. With all the swimming we did, about 18 minutes, 18, 19 minutes. It could be more than that, though, to be honest. But I don't think we were even close to the elite challenge. Not even the slightest. All right, go on. 20. <laughs> yeah, I was even good on myself there. Yeah, so it doesn't matter. But that was incredible. That was absolutely incredible. I actually really enjoyed that one. I mean, yes, it was long, but we were all over the place. I can't believe we didn't trigger any alarm. There was so many times during our escape there that I thought we triggered the alarm. There was so many times. It just plays tricks on you because you can see their cone facing you. And then just as they get out of reach, the cone vanishes. And when the cone vanishes, I usually always assume that's because the alarm's been triggered. But no, it didn't. Alas, we're good. But anyway, ladies and gentlemen, I hope you enjoyed that video as much as I enjoyed making it. If you did, please consider hitting that like button. Subscribe if you're new to the channel. Turn on notifications so YouTube lets you know when I upload more videos. And I hope you enjoy the rest of your day. I hope you're having a fantastic weekend. And I will see you guys, as always, tomorrow. Turn around. <gasps> with a brand new video. Goodbye.